The clock continues to tick in Denver for teachers in the school district to reach an agreement on a new contract. If no deal can be reached by the weekend, we could be looking at a strike vote. Nine News reporter Nelson Garcia is at the negotiations which started this morning and are expected to go right up to those final minutes on Friday. Nelson? Tom, will there be a strike vote? That question will be answered over the next 30 hours or so. The last strike here in Denver was in 1994 and it lasted five days. Are these negotiations headed down the same path? While people wait to see if a strike can be avoided. Now what you're going to do, you take your index finger. Bernie Lopez entertains the kids. He's a retired teacher here to offer support. As union negotiator Rob Gould puts a new offer on the table. Uh, we mentioned that we were willing to consider a lot of things, that you, a lot of your ideas, a lot of what you might want to do, if you were willing to look at structure, like a structure like other districts. And there's your apple. Let me let go. I got it. Good job, apple. give me five. Okay. Lopez is here because he's been there before. 25 years ago, he was one of those teachers on strike, fighting for more pay and power. It was extremely, extremely scary. I thought, that there was a possibility that I'd lose my job. As a new strike nears, how you are handling transition costs. Superintendent so Susana Cordova says she wants to give the union proposal due consideration. Would ask uh, probably just for a little bit of grace in return, knowing that um, we want to be as thoughtful as we can in looking at your proposal and, and looking at um, how we understand it to work uh, to determine, you know, how we want to respond. The sticking points now base salaries, incentives for teachers, and a simplified pay structure. Push it in, don't let go. feels history just Push might be it repeating itself. I'm fighting for teachers. We need to recognize them. We need to honor them. We need to compensate them for what they are worth, for what they do. If a deal cannot be reached by midnight tomorrow night, the Denver Classroom Teachers Association will have a strike vote on Saturday. If they vote to strike, the superintendent says she will ask the state to intervene. But after two years of negotiations, the state may not have any reason to step in. If the, that does happen, the earliest the teachers could walk the picket line would be on January 28th. Tom. All right, Nelson, thanks very much. We are down to crunch time. Mm -hmm.